joy of cup football is you really can't predict what's going to happen. Maybe the same these days about the league games because the sense of competition is so good. But in the cup, it's not always about performance. It is all about results. Yeah, and I think there are some players, certain characters, that can handle cup competitions better. It suits them more. I just wonder which side has got those characters. Olympic Marseille's lineup. Florian Tovin starts with Lucas Ocampos on the flanks. Valère Germain is the lone striker today. Check for you on the Nantes team now. And we're putting the opposition up here as 4-3-3 as well. Alan, could it be more of a 4-5-1? Yeah, I think so. Maybe when they're trying to absorb the pressure, I think they'll try and stay nice and solid and just leave the one man up front. Marseille have kicked off. Luis Gustavo. Lopez. Well, he's got support here. Here's Lopez. Luis Gustavo. Luis Gustavo. And here's the shot. Given that he tried to place it, he got it rather wrong. Yeah, probably did choose the wrong option. Should have tried to get some power behind that shot. It's with Toure. Rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. And the referee asserting his authority here early on, giving that free kick. Well, he can't go for goal, but it is a dangerous situation, this, because uh, if he gets it on the money, it's going to be hard to defend against. Delivered quickly. <laughs> Referees officiating properly here within the laws of the game. Quite entitled to give that as a free kick. Although early, sometimes the players expect to get away with it, I think. <laughs> Camera. Luis Gustavo. Here's Lopez. And they've spread it out wide here. But it's come off the goalkeeper, still in play. Defended well. Luis Gustavo. Payet. Maxime Lopez. Tova. Here's Lopez. Luis Gustavo. With Payet again. Just making sure that each pass is successful. When they'll see a chance for a forward pass, they'll flick a switch. Could get the ball into the box now. Well, it is a chance to relieve some of the pressure here by simply 
having the ball. Payet. Luis Gustavo. Payet. Will it be for Mar And it's a shot now! Very, very close, just past the post. Well, I think half the crowd, you know, thought that one was going to nestle in the corner of the net there. Can really get at the opposition here. Well, that's good support play from his teammates. Player right at him, but he's kept the ball well. Brilliant defending. It saved a certain goal. He was almost wheeling away to celebrate there. Swung in from the corner. And they've scored. And they've opened the scoring here. <laughs> Sensational strike there for the goal. I know they work hard on these set pieces, and that corner was perfect. And here is another angle on that goal. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Luis Gustavo. Luis Gustavo into the attacking third. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Payet. The shot's on. That's a good block. They've lost the ball and the counter-attack could be there. Room now out of the wing. And that will be a free kick. He's normally good from these set plays, and uh, his teammates are expecting a good ball in. And they get it away. Being closed down here. Bit of space for him. Now out on the wing. Payet. And now the shot. Luis Gustavo. Shot blocked here. Given away by Marseille. They can be quick on the break now. Still progressing on the break. Put in from the wide area. Great chance to get a greater hold on the game. They might just live to regret that miss. That's well taken by the goalkeeper off his line. Maybe took his eye off the ball. Toure. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. It's a good cross. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems and certainly not the goalkeeper you would have thought that Marseille would have put on a better showing than we've seen to this point I mean to be fair there's not that much in the game but they are trailing and they need to play better plenty of width for the team to attack into cleared the ball
That will be a throw for Marseille. Luis Gustavo. Lopez. Payet. Maxime Lopez. The attacking team have got a problem here because the opposition are just sitting in and saying, well, you can break us down if you can. They think perhaps they can't break them down. Attacking now. In on the goalkeeper. Got to be. And it's in. The equalising goal. He followed his instincts. He followed the play in. And then he followed watching the ball into the net. Yeah, a lesson for any schoolboy. Just to make sure you follow shots in, that you're in that danger area. It is uh, level, both sides have scored here now. And the board has gone up to indicate three added minutes. It's with Toure. Lucas Evangelista. Well, that's not so much an interception as a poor pass. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Fabio. Shot on! Plenty of power, but not... So here we are at half-time, and it's 1-1. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Well, a really good late equalising goal, and that might just change the manager's team talk now. And they kick off at the start of the second half. Probing away, trying to find room for a shot, maybe. The uh, attack has fizzled out here, goal kick. Just a quick note for your diaries on EA Sports presenting the Ligue 1 fixture. Marseille, they'll be facing Rass away from home. Yeah, it's uh, an important tie for both sides, three points at stake. Interesting to see who comes out on top. Can't keep the ball at the moment. It's with Toure. Good vision. Read the play well to intercept. Camera. Here's Lopez. Tova. Sa. And Marseille are on the move now. Maxime Lopez. And they're keeping the ball. That's the important thing. Luis Gustavo. Here's Lopez. Payet. Gunasa. Keeper not taking any chances. Not wanting to catch that one, he's punched it away. And now the shot! Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Maybe the cross. Very good piece of work by the goalkeeper to turn that away from danger. Florian Tova. Gunasa. Toure. He works so hard on his heading. He needs to do a bit more work, I think. Yeah, the keeper's waving that one bye bye.
did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Gives it away. Tova. Guiding the pass through. Now, can he take them on? Marseille's throw. Well, Alan, here's the substitution now. Yeah, he certainly chipped in with a really good performance and got a good goal too. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there, and pass goes straight to the opposition. Luis Gustavo. I don't know whether the managers told them to do this, but they're just defending deep and saying to the opposition, you can have the ball, you're not going to hurt us. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. And here's the shot. Well, he hit it well enough. Yeah, maybe just a bit off balance there, actually. Tova. Lopez. Quick witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Well, that's not so much an interception as a poor pass. Well, most of these supporters came in expecting to see their team win. It hasn't all gone according to plan, but they're pushing them on now. Now a chance to get a bit of width into this attack. Now, this is an interesting attack. Well, here comes the support. Shots off! Here's a chance, goalkeeper exposed. Counting down towards the end of the 90 minutes. Nine minutes left. Right from the beginning, we've never known which way this game is going to go, and it, it's kept its drama right to the last. Luis Gustavo. Good forward play this from Marseille. Tova! Maybe took his eye off the ball. Mina. Bunasa. Maxime Lopez. Luis Gusta. Should be. Luis Gustavo. Trying to get the ball. Well, time for one last attack now. They're looking for a late winner. Can they get it? Well, there'll be two added minutes. And he's got his block in and the cross... It is the penalty shootout. Great to watch, but not too uh, easy to partake in, I'm sure.
start now at the shootout. Oh, too close. Keeper's kept it out. So next up to take the penalty. They've let him get away with that little stuttering run-up. Goal stands. Somehow he saved it. It's time to step up. Well, he's up to the task with his penalty. Excellent work from the keeper. Well, it's down to him now. If he scores, they win the game. Good save. Well, all the pressure is on the kick taker here. If he doesn't score, they'll lose the game. Beat the goalkeeper well in this penalty shootout. Well, he knows now one successful shot and they've won it. And he's put it away to get the winning penalty. Well, it can look easy, can't it? And he's made it look easy there. Well, there's a goal that's perhaps not gone according to the script here. They just picked their moment to get forward after a lot of defending. Yeah, and they can thank the defenders for that, but uh, when they did get the ball, they moved it forward really quickly. They were, they were ruthless there. There's no doubt having a good, confident penalty taker makes a big difference. We've seen that today. Yeah, it could be a tremendous asset. You can get into double figures and 20 goals or whatever if you can convert from 12 yards, and that's the way it ended up today.